one third, uh, uh, you know, a lot of kids are home seeing mom and dad working, doing stuff. Washington Post says uh, uh, the pandemic has actually given kids a chance to see their parents at work, see what they do, how hard they work. Uh, and I think that's great. I I've been very fortunate. I One of my favorite things to do when I was a kid was to ride the bus with my dad, to watch him oh, work. Cool. He would take me to work. And it was great because, you know, he was a bus driver in Brooklyn, you sit there in the depot and they take you to the vending machine, either buy you candy or it was, it was <laughs> that's the only reason. I don't want to spend time with my father. I just wanted the free food. No, I was just going to ask if you let Nick play with the touch screen. Do you let him actually forecast? He has no interest in that. Uh, uh, you know, he, he had, for the first couple of weeks, he was getting up and helping me set up the lights. That lasted two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's like, you know, hey, hey, dude, where are you? Uh, uh, <laughs> but long before take your, your children to work day, I was bringing the kids in. Around what age? Because I still find it stressful. Oh. Like I'll bring one in, but I've never had all three in, unless it was like a surprise for me. From the show, yeah, I've never had all three. I've had two in, but uh, because of the age difference. But no, I th I think it's great for them to see what you do. But I agree, Chanel. It is the most stressful thing. And Deborah oh. will always say, "Why don't you take them in with you?" I said, "Well, why don't you take?" Yeah. Them in? She, <laughs> she goes to work. She's not on live. This is live TV. I mean, we have examples of Nick busting in on my <laughs> broadcast when I like was down in Washington, and I was like, ah! you know. It, it, you're so stressed out. It's stressful, stressful. It's so funny because I thought the kids would think in some ways that they had me more. And they, I think they do to a certain extent, but lately they feel like I work all the time. And I think it's because of what we do now when we do these interviews or Zoom interviews or Skype interviews, we're doing them all day. So mm -hmm. I started at 6 a.m. yesterday, but my last Skype interview yesterday was at four. And so the mm -hmm. kids are like, you're working all the time. And I'm like, wow, I never thought I'd hear that. It's funny you say that because be because we work kind of stretched out throughout the day, like we have this right now and leading up to this, it's like, let me get everything done that I need to get done. So it's like, Calvin, I can't play because I, I need to do this laundry. I have to pack for vacation. I have to do this, this, and this. And then he's like, you can play now. And it's like, oh no, I have to go back to work. You know? So it's <laughs> like, we're here, but we're not here. And I'm trying to explain that to him, but he's you like, no, know, you're here i want to play i want to play i want to play i want to play i'm like stop stop talking sorry how about your kids Craig? getting stressed yeah, you know it's <laughs> funny because initially when all this started they would say in the morning they all oh, day you got to go into the city for work you got to go in the city for work blah, blah blah they didn't i don't think they thought that working from home was an option so mm -hmm. for the first two weeks it was a, a foreign concept when i would disappear into the the dungeon here and daddy's gonna go and, and do his cable show. And then one day, maybe it was about three weeks in, they discovered Lindsay had the show on in the kitchen. Mm. And they were like, and then they realized I was doing it from downstairs. Uh. And I was like, it's a game change. So once a week, uh, I let them come down here. I, I could probably show you. I let them come down and sit nice on that couch. <laughs> Right. So you sit on the couch. That's cool. Oh, that's nice. And do they stay quiet? Oh, no, no, no. They only come until like five minutes before. Then I make them go back upstairs that's because nice. the last thing is for them to interrupt the cable news broadcast these days. Hey, having another edition of Overheard on 3rd. We'd love to hear from you. How have you been doing during this pandemic? Why don't you send up some videos? Uh, go to at 3rd Hour Today and post them for us. And we'll try to get them on and share them with you.